This small and densely packed square, called Piazza San Giovanni in Monte, is overlooked by another of Bologna's historic jewels, the Church of San Giovanni in Monte. The polished facade is inspired by artistic themes of Veneto and Ferrara, around the mid-15th century, and this eagle which dominates the portal is an emblem of the evangelist John and was moulded by Nicola del Arca, around 1481. Smack bang in the middle of the church is this peculiar classic column with a reverse capital surmounted by a Romanesque cross. It is a unique remainder of the old small chapel of Bologna. The wooden Christ dates back to the 16th century. The church resembles more of an art gallery judging by the many paintings that cover its walls, pillars and altars. Artists who contributed to this superb art gallery include Ercole de Roberti, Domencino, Cima di Colignano, Perugino, Lippo de Maceo, Cortino, as well as this famous painting of St. Celia surrounded by other saints by the Italian High Renaissance painter Raphael. Unfortunately though, what you're seeing is only a copy since the original is now preserved in the Pinoteca Nazionale the National Picture Museum of Bologna. This next piece of art of St. Anna is actually made from ceramic. It was produced by Minghetti and dated 1906. Fifteen centuries ago, the natural hill on which the church and its monastery is raised lay outside the walls of ancient Bononia and was a holy place visited by pilgrims as an imitation of the Mount of Olives in Jerusalem. Since the 5th century, San Giovanni in Monte was rebuilt many times. It achieved its present arrangement only towards the middle of the 16th century by means of the prestigious work of Antonio Marandi and of the subsequent one between 1602 and 1652 by Bartolomeo Belli. These curious signs on the floor, which can be found all over the church, are in fact marking the spot of tombstones. An underground chamber holds the tombstones, but as yet is not open to the public. The painting hanging over this altar is called Madonna della Salute. And it was painted by Giovanni da Modena and is dated back to the 15th century. Statues of numerous saints, including St. Paul and St. Peter, stand watch over the altar. The richness of styles that characterizes San Giovanni in Monte reveals a succession of different cultural ages. The Gothic style, the Renaissance style, and the more classical one which is typical of Bologna. Finally, this door that takes you along a curious walkway illustrates that artwork and tombstones are not just confined to the main church building, and it leads directly on to Via Farini. The French occupation of Bologna by Napoleon meant the suppression of the religious orders in the city, and of course the monastery of San Giovanni in Monte was suppressed too, in March 1797. San Giovanni in Monte was then employed as a prison and as the seat of a special criminal court.